Hi there, fellow managers. Today, we're diving into a skill that's absolutely essential in leading your teams effectively, empathy. You might have heard the term thrown around a lot, but what does it really mean for us as leaders? And more importantly, how can we develop empathy to foster stronger relationships and a healthier work environment? Empathy is about understanding and sharing the feelings of others. But at work, it goes deeper than just being nice. For managers, it's about truly tuning into the experiences of your team members, their frustrations, their joys, and everything in between. It's stepping into their shoes to see the world from their perspective, which helps us manage difficult conversations, offer support, and build trust. But why is empathy so critical for us as managers? Well, think about this, when an employee feels heard, understood, and valued, they're more motivated and engaged. On the flip side, a lack of empathy can lead to frustration, low morale, and even burnout. So how can we, as managers, start building more empathy into our leadership style? Tip number one, listen actively. This is one of the most powerful ways to show empathy. When an employee comes to you with a concern, give them your full attention. Ask questions, show interest, and acknowledge their feelings. When people feel heard, they also feel valued. Tip number two, acknowledge and validate emotions. If someone's frustrated about a project, for example, say something like, I see you're feeling frustrated. It's understandable given the challenges. This simple acknowledgement can make a world of difference. Tip number three, provide support and resources. Empathy isn't just about listening, it's about taking action. Whether it's offering training, coaching, or simply pointing them to the right tools, showing that you care about their success is key to creating a positive and supportive work environment. Empathy doesn't just benefit your team, it also makes you a better leader. It helps you navigate complex issues, understand what's really going on behind the scenes, and build strong, trusting relationships with your employees. Remember, empathy isn't a nice to have, it's an essential tool in your leadership toolkit. By understanding and caring for your team, you're not just creating a more positive workplace, you're building a culture of trust, collaboration, and growth. And if you are wondering that being empathetic will make you look weak, that's really not the case. We explored this recently in a podcast with Loren Sanders, who is an executive coach and author. You can find it on Risely. Until next time, keep listening, keep learning, and keep leading with empathy.